You're not here. We're not there. The car exploded. Come get the girls. I have to stay here with Woodrow. I'm not the chauffeur. I'm the grandfather. Where are you? Asteroid City, Farm Route 6, Mile 75. Last train. Junior stargazers and space cadets. Each year we celebrate Asteroid Day. Commemorating September 23rd, 3007 BC, when the arid plains meteorite made Earth impact. Holy Toledo, that's Mitch Campbell. You're very good in the one about the tramp in the brothel Thank who you. gets amnesia and Thank becomes you. a pediatrician. You were very awesome. Actually, maybe my favorite character ever. I don't know why nobody else liked it. Oh. What do those pulses indicate? What? Oh, the beeps and blips? We don't know. Some of our information about outer space may no longer be completely accurate. Anyway, there's still only nine planets in the solar system as far as we know, Billy. Except now there's an alien. What's happening now? I don't know. I don't like the way that guy looked at us. The alien. How did he, how did he look? Like we're doomed. Maybe we are. I've just informed the president. How long can they keep us in Asteroid City, legally? The world will never be the same. That's an alien doing jumping jacks. That's an alien in a top hat. What's out there? The meaning of life. Maybe there is one. Are you married? I'm a widower, but don't tell my kids. You're saying our mother died three weeks ago. Let's say she's in heaven, which doesn't exist for me, of course, but you're Episcopalian. In my loneliness, I learned to give complete and unquestioning faith to the people I love. I don't know if that includes you, but it included my daughter and your four children. Sometimes I think I feel more at home outside the Earth's atmosphere. Oh, wow. Me too. They're strange, aren't they? They're children. Compared to normal people. Yes, that's correct. It's true. Mm -hmm. Freight train, freight train, going so fast. Freight train, freight train, going so fast. I do a nude scene. You want to see it? Huh? Did I say yes? You didn't say anything. Uh, I meant yes. My mouth, my mouth didn't speak. A lot has happened since my big fat Greek wedding. Like I never left. Woo! My father passed away, and his last wish was for us to visit his childhood village and reconnect with our roots. So, we're having a reunion. We're going to Greece. Oh, yeah. One, two, three, four. And by we, I mean oh, the whole family. Oh. Who wants souvlaki? Paging souvlaki. Anybody by the name of souvlaki on this flight? Aristotle, what? I didn't know you were going to be here. What are you doing here? They had an amazing date. She ghosted him. You are the Portocalos family. We are related through your papu's papu, who was married to my great, great Yaya sister, sister in law. I want Bula. I will be your favorite. I promised my dad I would find his best friend. I know them. Do they still live here? No. How do we find them? They will come for the reunion. Did they tell you they're coming? No. There's no other bedrooms. Family sleepover. <laughs> this is one reunion. <laughs> we'll never forget. Do you know these men? No. I am surprised, but I am not surprised because I'm never surprised. You lost me. We dreamt about Aristotle last night. How did you know? Greek voodoo. Bam! I remember your story. I really need to find my dad's friends. Angelo and I are on it. Okay, bye. Let's do it! I'm calling it. You got us back to Greece. You're the head of the family now. Yeah, I can't really day drink like this. Don't worry, a lady is never drunk. <laughs> Pick the one we have for dinner. Oh, thank you. Uh, I'm a vegetarian. No. We got these problems. Today is going to be the best day ever. I love sunshine. I love butterflies. But more than anything, I love Doug. Hey! Shut the f up. He's a That's Doug, the best owner in the world. <sighs> We're playing this game called Fetch and Fetch. He drops me off really far away and drives home without me. 
When I bring the ball back, he says, <laughs> That's how I know I won the game. Hey, honey, you ever been with an Afghan before? I don't think so, but thank you. Take it from me, kid. He left your ass. No, that can't be right. You are officially a straight. That would mean Duck doesn't love me. Poor little guy. I should probably talk to him. I am a therapy dog. Reg, you can learn how beautiful it can be when you're off the leash. This beer is making me dizzy. It's about to get real dizzy up in this I'm having a great time. This motherfucker right here. What you want, huh, Let's homie? Go. Look, ass friend with the home permit. What did you just say? Hey, you I would hate for this to get violent. You were straight. You can do anything you want. I'm going back to Doug's. What? Man. And he needs to pay for what he did with the only thing he truly loves. I'm going to bite his off. Oh, wait, did he just say my yeah, I, I'm still a little drunk, but... I said, I'm going to bite his off. Oh, we go. Oh. Uh. You don't know me like that. Big day today. You ever humped anything before? I wouldn't say I've humped, per se. There you go, Red. I'm doing good. Tell it no, you're his daddy. Hey, no, I'm your father. It's good to finally meet you. Reggie. Even under these strange circumstances. Oh, Reggie. Reggie. We're completely lost, and my little puppy paw pads are really hurting right now. So how exactly could this get worse? Holy We've got a d to rip off. Y know me like that. What are those? Kind of looks like food. Oh, uh, give me a sec. You look different. You look different too. How so? Is it my human hands? The patient has lost the ability to speak. He's not deaf and he's technically not mute. With the proper amount of care, it's possible that he could regain his understanding of the world, his ability to speak. What's our first course of action? Well, the state is not going to pay for any of that, so we are going to put his ass on the first bus downtown. What, what do you mean he won't get out of the trailer? Get in. Take a look at this guy. What about him? He's a dead ringer for you! Man don't look nothing like me. I mean, look at him, he's too short. Get finished a day for you. <laughs> Action! Cut! Latte pronto! Excuse me, Mr. Pronto. Can I call you Latte? Latte! Latte pronto! Latte pronto! Is that your oh, name? God, I, I'm amazing. So you and me are gonna do big things, pal. And respect, bro. Mo, Mo, stars coming through! Welcome to your team. You got me, your agent, got your manager, lawyer, publicist, personal assistant, plus we got you an intern. You have got a big film premiere tomorrow night. Does that make you a little nervous? <laughs> this was a gift from Prince Harry. It was one of the original Knights of the Round Table sword or something. Can't really remember because I wasn't listening when he gave it to me. Make love to me, Latte. The phone is not ringing. Don't worry, pal. I'll get it back on top. I know you think what's been happening to your career is accidental. Everything is by design. Who are you really, Latte Pronto? I get down big time. Meet the residents of Element City. Air usually has their head in the clouds. Oh, my new jacket. Earth can be a little seedy. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing weird going on here. Uh, just a little pruning. Water is always getting into something. Fire? As ordered. We run a little hot. <laughs> this shop is dream of our family. Someday it'll all be yours. But we all live by one simple rule. Elements cannot mix. 
the pipe squished me all out of shape. Dang. That's better. Oh. So you've never left Firetown? Sorry, buddy. Elements don't mix. Whoa. Hey! Plus, my dad would boil you alive. Why does anyone get to tell you what you can do in your life? Come on! Why do they even have these? Eh, who knows. Watch this! Whoa! Ember, I see a change in you. Water guy? You live here? It's my mom's place. We got two kids that are swimming around here somewhere. Orca! Follow! What? <laughs> I've been trying to fill my father's shoes. I never once asked what I wanted to do. Try this! Dad, those are too hot. I love hot food. <laughs> We all write our own stories. There is Richard. I'd like to speak to him. I'm here. This is mine. That's me, the Mero Mero, Mr. Richard Montañez. I'm the guy who helped bring the world the most popular snack it's ever seen. Are you ready? I will. I've been ready. All right, all right. It was a little bit more like this. Spicy? Yeah, see, that's how I got here. Dear God, please forgive me for the gang, the drugs, the stolen cars. What the heck, man? Let's move it. Hey, he is praying, pendejo. Go ahead, baby. The guy started at the very bottom. I know I don't look it, but I got a PhD. Hmm. I'm poor, hungry, and determined, sir. Okay, I can see you're going to be a weird one. What's happening? Layoffs, son. Lots of them. Frito Lay isn't getting enough orders to keep the factory open. Who eats Cool Ranch anyway? That lady. What is it? It burns. You stop eating it? No, I like it. It was good. I had been searching for an answer. And there it was. They had been there the entire time. I got an idea. It's a spicy chip. It's going to change everything. It will save our factory. And you're a janitor. No, 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 hang on. No one can kill you. Figure out the next step. Say, the Hispanic market will not be ignored. The Hispanic market will not be ignored. <laughs> Good, but in your voice. You got the vibe inside. Why are we wasting time on this janitor's crazy idea? Guys like you and me, we don't get shots like this. You see that guy right there? I see a chingon, a montañez. Yo soy montañez. De montañez. Get out there and be great. We want to know that we matter to you. If we knew that there was a product out there for us, we say, take all our money, cabrones. I got a little hood there at the end, but. Ow, 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 burn. Burn good or burn bad? I burn good. Oh! <laughs>
You've only been here a few days. What the? I can't work with these guys. For them, it's like some sort of game. It is a game, Thomas. That's it, Jaya. Leadership. Now we're making some progress. Dear Lord, thank you for sending us Mr. Rongan. We've become quite attached to him. It's like finding a little lost white kid at the mall and telling him which way to go. I, I can't believe it. I just can't believe it. No, can I? I feel like I just saw him. Yeah, he just called me last week. It was a butt dial, but still. What are we gonna do with these ashes? Where was Durfee the happiest? Easy. Harrison. It's perfect. You know, you think about it, that is where it all began. Oh my god, it's spring break. You remind me of my granddad. Granddad? How old do you think I am? I don't know. Oh, 40? Oh. It's time for the party game! Oh, this son of a bitch straight up stole our games! Oh, oh my god! I get her number? Welcome to the ultimate game. This is our reminder. To be mindful. Be mindful of history and her story and they story. Just kill us now. Come! Your chariots away. This is gonna be fun, isn't it, buddy? These people suck. What will your journey be? You guys want some? Those are magic mushrooms. I just ate 10 of these things. <laughs> Come on, you gotta trip no, on these. I'm not taking any mushrooms. I'll eat these pink things, though. Ooh. You're a jerk, guys. You got a little mustache. Why'd you grow your hair out? One tap of the tongue is the most powerful hallucinogen. How are you doing? You're welcome, sweetheart. <laughs> Two. Not here, it's not. Hey, they letting yoga instructors in the gym now. Ball. I just noticed you're not getting enough legs on a new shot. Are you dehydrated? 100 bucks, you can't make more shots. Let's just do 300. It's not my dad's money. We ain't never gonna get a reparation that way, bro. So I prefer Venmo or Zelle, but you seem like a Cash App guy, so. Ladies and gentlemen, C5. You think it's slick, huh? Showing up to court dressed like a dumbass, acting like you can't hoop. You assumed I couldn't hoop because I'm white, which is incredibly outdated. No, I assumed you couldn't hoop because you were dressed like a white girl at Whole Foods. What a love girl. Let's go. It's really hard to plan for the future when we're always worried about money because you're out here living in a fantasy. My 30-day detox program. You want a free sample? No, I ain't drinking no boo-boo juice. Wait, it's almost the first. I'm gonna go tomorrow, I forgot. Why don't you just go now? It'll be fine. Hey, don't worry, Mommy. Don't worry, Mommy. Every hooper I know is entering that big ass tournament with a winner get five hundred thousand. I just need somebody who can play so I can make some money. You're joking, right? Five hundred thousand for one day of hoop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are right. We can hustle a few games together to get the money for the entry fee. I'll find some marks. Those short shorts look incredible on you. Throw them off their game. You have an OnlyFans, and we'll clean up. You gonna wear that trash bag? You gonna wear that fake ass Richard Simmons outfit? Oh. Uh, so, I don't know, bro. I bet y'all got one coming in these days. Release for me. Release for me. That's the bad out there. It's enough joke. Then the sun dies. Don't spend any of the money until we can cover the fee. I should be saying that to you. Well, I'm good with money. So am I. So am I. Me too. Me too. Where? Word, bro. If she gives me that a drug store. If she can not see you. Double cup toast. I got a dump for. Pull a hundo. That a love go. Buckets. What? Just wanted to see if you had superhuman hearing because of your... Because of my what? They're gonna kill him in the parking lot. I'm out here. He got a flamethrower. Flamethrower? What is this, Mad Max? Five, four, three, two, I let one go. I don't go, bro. I don't know how much you talking to your ass played in today, but good work. Thank you. 
You could talk way more trash out there. You have so much material I can't even touch. Like what? Never mind. Oh. Tell us. Where the love go? My name's Miles Morales. I'm Brooklyn's one and only Spider-Man. And things are going great. He's gonna be here any minute. Should be simple enough. Give me your money. So are you like a cow or a Dalmatian? Ah, Spider-Man! I am the spot. <laughs> That's not funny. Don't, don't do that. There's bubbles now, hold on. I don't think I want this costume anymore. Oh, in a minute. Hey, he wrote it all as one word. That's cute, right? The youth. How's this going? Miles. College. What we always woo, woo. Miles' grades are pretty good. A in AP Physics. That's my little man. And a B in Spanish. What? Woo, okay. Miles. Are you trying to Mira, that's my name. Okay. I gotta go. All right, have a Bye. Miles. Gwen. Wanna get out of here? Welcome to Spider Society. I'm Spider Man. Oh, no way. All of us are. Meet Miguel O'Hara. He's like a ninja vampire Spider Man, but a good guy. Plus, he's like such a good leader. Miles, there's moments in our stories that are the same for all of us. Some good. Did you bring our baby to another fight? I knew I was going to regret making her that web shooter. <laughs> You asked me not to, so I, I didn't. I wouldn't. I'm bad. You have a choice between saving one person and saving every world. To me, that's an obvious choice. Send me home. I can't do that. I can do both! All stations, stop Spider-Man. You? You want me? Miles! Everyone keeps telling me how my story is supposed to go. Nah, I'm gonna do my own thing. Can this day get weirder? I guess it can. There's nowhere to run. Sorry. My bad, everybody. There was somewhere to run. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't looking where I was going. Are you okay? Yeah, Are fine. Okay? Thanks. Bye. Oh, here, it's my fault. Let me help you up. I'm Elaine. Ten years ago, we created the robots to now do the tasks Americans once did. Thomas Newton was sentenced to 28 years after he had an illegal robot double of himself. You hear that, robot? Yes, Charles. We need to be more careful. This new girl is different level. I'm glad you've met a nice young lady. I need you completely focused on getting her horizontal for me. Put yourself in deep program now, C2. Charles guy really wants to bang me, so he'll have to take over tomorrow, we do. Yes, Elaine? I just don't want the night to end. I feel the same way. C2, where are you? C2, pick up your phone. I've never done this before. One, two, three! The Elaine also has a robot double. You were dating a robot all along. You 2 and I are running away together. Don't try to stop us. What? Goodbye, Elaine. Goodbye, Charles. Let's just talk about this. Deviant. Don't, <laughs> don't do it. <laughs> Childish. Oh. This is terrible. They've completely stolen our lives. I'm gonna have to get a real job. We hunt them down and we kill them. Um, two cappuccinos. Thank you. You guys don't understand. They're not going to be obedient anymore. They're humanizing. They're learning to feel. You want to get married immediately. Let's go. Go where? To stop our wedding. Your disgusting joyride is over. <gasps> hey, I get to shoot me. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Well, fine, then I'm shooting you. That's not fair. It's swimming to shore. Oh my god. Oh my god. Shoot her again. Oh. She's deprogrammed now. She's feral. Charlie, want a pinky winky? No! Get off me! Hi, Barbie! Hi, Ken! Hi, Barbie! Hi, Barbie! Hi, Barbie! Hi, Barbie! Hi, Barbie! Hi, Barbie! Hi, Barbie. Hi, Ken! Hi, Ken.
with the radio blast and goes cruising just as fast as she can now. I thought I might stay over tonight. Why? Because we're girlfriend boyfriend. To do what? I'm actually not sure. I'm coming with you. Did you bring your rollerblades? I literally go nowhere without them. Oh, looks like this beach is a little too much beach for you, Ken. If I wasn't severely injured, I would beat you off right now, Ken. I'll beat you off with you any day, Ken. Anyone who wants to beat him off has to beat me off first. I will beat both of you off at the same time. Beat both of us off? Beach. Nobody's gonna beat anyone off. Court order for asset seizures. So they're taking my car? You went radio silent on me. Is that what this is about? My feelings for you were so intense that I got scared. Is that true? Buongiorno. That's my cousin. Gary, I swear to God, he's my cousin. Mm. He's my second cousin. There's something seriously wrong with you. I'm an Uber driver and I don't have a car. I'm gonna lose my house. You think I chose him? Look at this. Need a car, date our son this summer, and bring him out of his shell before college. In exchange, we'll give you a Buick Regal. Date is in quotes. Bet that means sex. My husband, the code breaker. We've just been so worried about our son. He's going to Princeton in the fall. Oh, I've heard of it. Yeah, we tried everything to bring him out of his shell. He doesn't come out of his room, he doesn't talk to girls, he doesn't drink. So when you say date him, do you mean date him or date him? Yes. Date him. Date him hard. Okay. I'll date his brains out. He volunteers at the animal shelter. Hi. Mind if I touch your wiener? What? Your dog. How about I give you a ride home? Um, this isn't the way to my house. It's a shortcut. You're my hostage. What you got down there? Something for me? <laughs> Why? You tried kidnapping me! You're 19, grow up! This kid is undateable. Have a drink together. He'll have a Long Island iced tea. This is the worst iced tea I've ever had. Dance party. I don't know what to do. I just know my mom would have wanted me to save the house. I'm probably just nervous. Why don't you loosen them up? You can go skinny dipping. What about sharks? Men here. Jellyfish? Not this season. It's really the lack of life charge. You're sitting here right now. Okay. I'm just a bit of a romantic. He's actually really sweet. The best part about getting older is not having to care what people think. I'm an adult now. I can make my own decisions. That's good. You want to savor it. Savor it. Come on, you're getting out of here. You don't belong here. Don't Let's touch me. Get away from her. Stay. Who is she going? Maddie, you can't outrun the cops. I can't lose my license. Standing six foot two inches. Matthew, stand. How long have they been doing that? That's three or four games. Weird, right? Yeah, I can see you hate it. Your kid, he had a good game. Where's he going to college? Oh, he's something to work for us. A family business, construction. I'm a scout. If you want me to make a few phone calls, there might be a hole here or there. Some of those holes have scholarships. Who let the dog out? <laughs> You know that's 20 years ago. I told him we should use uh, Ain't Gonna Be No Rematch. At the end of Rocky. That's 40 years ago. Who's this, Sticks? Oh, this is Danny. <laughs> nice to meet you. Yeah. Do not like her. Don't be mean in front of her. She don't know us yet. Come to dinner Sunday, 12 o'clock. Dinner at 12. I, I love it. I'll be there. Danielle's from Forest Hills. We worked on a house over there. Guy had a Maserati. <laughs> yeah, but it was yellow. No thanks. <laughs> Any more meatballs? Oh, I'll make us some more. Oh, no, 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 yes. please. Too late. No, 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 no. No, 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 he gets on that team, everything changes for him. You need to turn down the rah rah. What? I'm excited. Just let it be his choice. She broke up with me. I'm so surprised. Uh, your mom's hysterical because she doesn't like seeing you like this, getting hurt. 
He'll be okay. I just gotta get his mind off it, you know? Get him back on the court. Hey, Danny. He's not gonna make that team if he's sad like this. Maybe you could go back out with him. Like the pine trees lying in the winding road. Leo, what did you do? You humiliated him. I'm trying to I've save him from a lifetime of humiliation. I've got a name. I've got a name. He's so stupid sometimes. Moving me down the highway. I always try to do what I think is best for you. You know, you're lucky, Sticks. I have family that cares that much. Moving ahead so that won't pass me by. We call him Sticks, because of the long legs. Came out of the shoot that way, just kept growing. Still growing. Really? Came out of my shoot? Mr. Renfield, welcome. I am the action. You will make a very good assistant. No! He's evil. We will protect you. You have the word of the most trusted institution on Earth. The Catholic Church. Ah! Renfield, your sole purpose in life is to serve me. Now, let's eat. I just want a normal life again. God bless you, Mr. Renfield. Oh, God bless you, nuns. You're a hero. Robert Montague Renfield. Let me explain. I work for Dracula. Count Dracula? It's the real Dracula! Some call me the Dark One. Others, the Lord of Death. <laughs> so you bring in people to eat? Well, I do other stuff. Like what? Wash his cape? No. The cape is dry clean only. Strictly. Yeah, I will wear this, this fly, yeah. I don't think he's such a bad guy, but you're never really going to be free until you face him. I will no longer tolerate abuse. <laughs> I deserve happiness. Let me explain something to you, okay? You deserve only suffering. I will unleash an army of death. Everyone you care about will suffer because you betrayed me. We have to stop him before sunset. <laughs> And someone's like, it's okay, I've seen way worse. Everything I saw you do today is gonna be my way worse. It's my least favorite part of the job. I don't Uh, you, you guys must be new to town, right? New to town, but not new to the country. We just moved from California. Oh, we just wondered uh, if, if you wouldn't mind if your, your daughter played with our daughter. Audrey, say hi. You wanna play Sly? Mm -hmm. Slides off limits to Ching Chongs. <gasps> Fuck you. <laughs> Do you want to be best friends? Look at me, look at me, look at me now. Guess who's going back to the motherland? It's a big deal, going to your birth country. We used to talk about it all the time when we were little, remember? Grand adventure to find your birth mother. So proud of you. Wait, <laughs> people. Y'all calling me crazy. Be my translator in Beijing. Audrey, I got you. <laughs> Cat lives there now. Your famous college roommate. You ready to lose to a celebrity? Oh! Dead Eye is coming, by the way. Dead Eye, your cousin? Hey, Audrey. Oh, hi. Hey. Dead Eye. Where did that come from? You know, I think I get it. I called the adoption agency and she lives in Haiching. Okay, will you guys come with me? Fuck yes, bitch. I love a grand adventure. Oh, hi. So nice to see an American. What do you do for work? Hmm? Mm -hmm. It's the cops are doing a back check. Oh, oh my God, you're a drug dealer? You're drug dealers now, bitches! What the fuck? Is it a condom? We can't get caught with drugs in China. We'll get jailed for life. Crazy, you gotta go crazy, honey. Hey, go crazy, you gotta go crazy. I should never come to China. People are always thinking that I have this perfect life. I don't belong anywhere. If you do not know where you come from, how do you know who you are? We could 
still find her. Our passports are in my suitcase that got stolen. You know who can bypass the airport security? K-pop stars. Everyone remember their names? Sassy. Cutie. Lisa. Lisa, too. I don't believe these girls are sinners. Girls, show them. Um, <laughs> what are we supposed to show? You're a fan of Cardi B, right? Yeah. Is she here? There's some whores in this house. There's some whores in this house. You gotta go crazy! Hey, honey, you good? Did you get the Coke bags out? Yeah, but only seven, and I think I put in eight. Just push, pull. I mean, twist it. It's not a puppet, it's my asshole! Go crazy, crazy! Hello, you've reached the home of the retired and gifted. Where are you? I'm in a church. What? Are you serious? We're looking for a venue for the wedding. You are going to get married in a church? I'm shocked you didn't burst into flames as you crossed the threshold. <laughs> to Viv and Arthur. Oh, oh, thank, thank you. you. I think we should all go to Italy. Italy? Whoa. We'll make it Viv's bachelorette. A bachelorette trip? What are we doing? I think it's very romantic. But it's also nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Is a great walking city. Belle donne, le viti più vecchie danno l'uva più dolce. What did he say? The older the vines, the sweeter the fruit. Oh, oh yes, we still up. got it. I'm delighted that you'll be joining us tonight. There's no problem if four random women show up. This is Italy. There's always room for random beautiful women. Gianni, who is Gianni? What are you doing here? This is my cooking school. Wow. <laughs> uh, I'm here to start the animals' bush. Oh. I think somebody's bush is already oh. quite amused. It's too bridal. It's not bridal enough. Gorgeous. Someone else next. Oh! Don't move. What are you doing? That would be me. We're best friends for 50 years. And you? Married. Marriage. My solo act is finally coming to a close. You're the bravest person I know. The only question is how will we mess this all up? I can't wait to find out. <laughs> is it too soon to talk about who we're going to eat first? I think we all know. Hey. How does a woman in her 70s end up getting married? She takes control of her own destiny. This is a bachelorette party. You know what that means? We go see naked men. What's the protocol here? Where do I stuff the dollar bills? What do you want to be going to Lourdes for anyway? I always wanted to go there. How are you, Chrissy? My mother is dead. I'm in a place I swore I would never come back to. Hi. I wouldn't have recognized you. 40 years would do that, do you? I'd say, yeah, mixed. She's gonna help us if we go to Lourdes. Miracles happen there. He could speak. You <laughs> will. Holy Mary, Mother of God. Welcome to Lourdes. Oh, ah! We're ready. I'm not. Why did you leave? Leave? I was banished. I leave. I loved you and you left. I'm glad you came home. Can you ever forgive me? You don't come to Lourdes for a miracle, Eileen. You come for the strength to go on when there is no miracle. And there's always hope. Peace. That's what I hope for. A devoted wife and mother, a doting grandmother. Joyce was a wonderful woman. Joyce. Joyce. This is Claire, one of Joyce's oldest friends. They were at college together. Claire. Howard. I'm gonna kill you. Now that she's gone, I'm gonna do it this weekend. Evelyn, I need to talk to you. About what? I told him I was gonna kill him. I could chat. It's been four and a half decades. Feels like it was yesterday. You were delusional. She told me you were cruel. So, what's the plan, Scarface? 
I'm gonna buy a gun. Oh, it was cute. Very. Wanna hold it? And I'm gonna take it to the wake. How's the recoil? Recoil? I'm not gonna lie, it has a little kick. Well, darn it, we tried. Do you have any poison? I have a cyanide pill in case I'm captured by the enemy. You can have it. I want you to tell the truth. I am shocked by your utter selfishness. You blame me for what happened in your own marriage. I think you were not built for happiness. <laughs> I'm in. You're in what? My other murder canceled this week, so I've got time. I missed you. You had my number. Well, you had my number. So we're both lousy friends. Oh, Christ. Dad! Why, why are you carrying that knife? Oh, I was gonna stab someone. <laughs> <laughs> Crab cakes? Who is it? It's Ralph. I slept with him last night. Do you have a condom? I don't want to get knocked up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Rhea Khan. Yeah, yeah. I am going to be a stunt woman. Yeah, yeah. My sister Lena is the yeah, yeah. only person who believes in me. Want to help me with a vid for my channel? Please! No! Please! No! She helps me with all my training. You are going to be such a great stunt woman. <laughs> that was dope though. But lately, she's been seeing this guy who I think is a bit of a smarmy wanker. You know, it's a trap. Oh my God, Rhea, chill out. Now, I'm not being dramatic, but these people are evil. I found something. I've got my eye on you. They are not taking her away without a fight. I will strike down you or anyone else who tries to get in my way. How about the bikini area? <laughs> Let's dance. We need to get Lena out. How? Mischief is afoot. Lena's not going anywhere. You little bitch. Rude. Mom, what are you doing? Oh. We stick to the plan. Nothing changes. We are going to show Lena who these people really are. Let's decimate this mother! You're calling me crazy! Did you see my kick? Of course I bloody did. It was magical. I'm pretty sure I drew blood. Oh, hey, hey, hey. My parents are inviting us to the summer place for the big 4th of July weekend. I can't leave my father. This is the first summer since we have to say goodbye to your dear mother and you're going to leave me to burn the papas and eat the hot dogs alone. Why don't we just bring him? Nah, I don't think so. You hear this? Ladies. He's worried his immigrant father's gonna make him look like some kind of goomba. Listen, if we're gonna do this, Dad, you gotta dial it down with the, the, the with all the, 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 the this, this, the, the, what, what, what is this? Welcome to White Oak. Wow, this is amazing. Hey, Miss little dance, yeah? It's called love and affection, Dad. Unlike you, when you met me at the delivery room, you chose to shake my hand. What else was I supposed to do? We just met. Sebastian, I don't know how you're gonna fit in. Wait, what did Jake do? Where's my team? Where's my team? Don't these people have jobs? They got their money in the stock market. Not mayonnaise jars buried in their backyard. I just hope nothing gets stolen this weekend because these people love to blame the immigrants. We'll give you the grand tour. This is Doug. He's learning to be a healer. Hello. What are you doing? Just serenading our pet peacock. I love you. These people are strange. They are birds for pets. He's like family! The peacocks are just a bunch of goddamn show-offs, if you ask me. I was nervous to bring you here, but I didn't know you were going to spend the whole time embarrassing me. <laughs> How could you say that to your father? Here we 
go again. Everything I'm doing for you that I've ever done for you is for your own good. Hey, Dad, check it out. I could die. I'm trying to make sure that you don't make an ass out of yourself by trying to be somebody you're not. Woo! Oh, my God. Oh, shit. Sebastian, your suit. It's Versace. Do you like it? No, you moron. It's not up. Oh, oh. I would love to make a full Italian dinner for everybody. We don't keep a lot of food here. A man of scout who always finds a way to feed his family. Now's the time that we need. My father has an old Italian saying, family isn't one important thing, it's everything. I can't believe you put this all together from what we have in the kitchen. It's artichoke and poultry. So, so. Oh, no. Their pet peacock, and you thought I was crazy for worrying that you were gonna make us look like some bad Italian stamp. You know, That's right. To help me get rid of the evidence. Why does it seem like you've done this before? 